I'm Ryan. I'm Josh. We are Pop Culturist. This is Pop C T V. Uh, only at the popculturist.com. This week's experiment, we're gonna take Not a quite look. only. I mean it's on YouTube. It's yeah, but it's youtube.com slash the pop culturist, so it's sort of all ties together nicely. But this week's experiment is with E3. Electronics Entertainment Expo. <laughs> E3. Yes. E3 squared. Cubed. <laughs> e cubed. Yeah. Next week. When nothing but massive announcements happen. Supposedly. We thought. As I burp. I had to. <laughs> <laughs> and I crap, the cat just broke the door open. It's like a Velociraptor. Like he knows how to open like, the door. He's, he's tiny. Yet he can somehow crank that door. Dylan at any point could have stopped this from happening. <laughs> but he's just watching. He's... Okay, Rufus is fine. Good. Rufus has his own E3 prediction. He does, he does indeed. So we're going to predict... <laughs> More cat We're going to have a look at what we think will happen, what we think will be announced at E3. Okay. I'm going to kick things off. Let's just get straight into it. No fucking around. Okay. This one is an e- This is a showing. This isn't easy. Okay. I'm talking 0.5 uh, generations of consoles. I'm talking... We, of we, all, we're, right, you mean... Of consoles, you mean PlayStation Xbox? PlayStation Xbox. I, I believe that we will be getting a... We're getting an, an, a, at least an official announcement, maybe a price, uh, and a release... Yeah, release window price for the PlayStation 4. I believe it will be referred to as PlayStation... Probably PlayStation 4K is the most common yeah. one. Um, it makes sense. Like, Neo doesn't quite clearly a code name. Um... I, I four point four point yeah anyway. yeah four point five is is a silly name but it will be there and on the Xbox side we will get to coincide with what we've reported on previously being their slim version of a console yeah which will make it not look like a VCR mm-hmm. uh, and we will get their version of a, of the next gen which will be the Xbox Scorpio okay. I don't know what it will be called Scorpio. but I believe they will be announced I think. I think the, the slim version of the Xbox will be announced first. That'll be coming out first yeah, with yeah. the uh, <clears throat> 0.5 probably in the next year. I'd say 0.5 as close to VR launch as possible. Well, so I'm talking for, so for PlayStation, yes, I'm going to yeah. say oh, probably an October or early November release. Oh, yeah. If they can get the ship, if they can get the, enough. The thing is, though, will time. Xbox then be under pressure to get theirs out around the same time up before they lose a lot of steam? See, the tough part is, I mean, in order to get even expected demand on those consoles, they're going to have to manufacture a lot in a reasonably small time. They're probably already being manufactured. We would, we, if it was, we'd be leaked a bit more. Mm. We'd have a prototype somewhere or something. They are prototypes. The devs, all the devs have them. Mm, true. Because we were like, no, it's like we would get a photo. Like, someone would have leaked it. Like, uh, um, I think I was talking about on PlayStation Beyond. I'd imagine right now, only... The AAA Sony devs have them. They're not the only of, first parties. They're not the kind of people who are going to be leaking. Them no, the first stuff. parties be pretty well, pretty good. Well, to piggyback off that, the four point five. Yeah, I'm going to go with what may or may not be obvious, but a launch title for the four point five will be God of War four. That's my next one, actually. God of War. Yeah. Yay! Because you know, God of War has always been a fucking beautiful game, mm. if anything, except for Kratos being mad all the time. That gets annoying. Is he in shot? Is Kratos, is Kratos in shot? Yeah, Kratos. Oh, he's not as mad as mine. I put the angry face on. Yeah, he did. Um, obviously, it's been a while since God of War. They've remastered the last few, all of them now. Uh, the one and two and one the two, PSP uh, ones were remastered for PS3. Yeah. With God of War three being remastered for PS4, which is yeah. you can tell that's once very similar to the Skyrim with Bethesda. Is they're just testing how to run. Yeah, it yeah. Um, well, I think that's what's going to be. <clears throat> Probably the majority of the... Fo- if, if they show the po- PS4.5, the majority of the footage shown <coughs> will probably coincide with an announcement of God of War 4. Yep. Or God of War 4, or God of War, you know, semicolon, whatever, blah. Mm. Um, and that's going to be the gameplay footage we're seeing. Yep. To, and like, look how good this looks. And to coincide with, with previous speculation as well, it will be... Uh, it won't be Kratos, but it will be the Nordic... Gods. That's fine. Which is the rumor. I had a big thing Mill for Nordic Gods. I love it. I'm t- I, 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 lo- I really like God of War, so I'm really, really happy to get I my hands back in there. One. I finished one and two, and then finished three. Mm. I, I played Ascension one. for a bit, and I've finished both the, the PSP ones. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what's next? What's coming? My next on the list is <clears throat> Rockstar Games. 
Mm. They uh, take two interactive who own Rockstar, who are the parent company of Rockstar. They have confirmed that they will be at E3 in a like a big bad way. In a big way. Okay. Yep. Uh, it de- dep- uh, we won't see <clears throat> a Rockstar game coming out in the next fiscal year. I don't mm. think. I think they actually mentioned as well it won't come out in the next fisc- fiscal year. <clears throat> Future plan. So I think it'll either be like when they say a new game. I think that we we may get that. Uh, Red, Red Dead Redemption Remaster they were talking about. Mm-hmm. I think it could be Red Dead 2. Mm-hmm. Um, but I... They'll, somewhat, they'll either... They'll, they won't, may not be a release announcement of a game, but they may certainly show plans to one. Or go, hey, Red Dead 2 is in the works. Yeah. But <coughs> At which here point, is If it's in the, the works, remaster. they'll have concept art and stuff. <coughs> yeah. Uh, I'd be excited for the Red Dead Remaster because I've never played it. Mm. I feel like I've really missed out. But I feel like going back to play it now, I'm not, it's not going to have the same kind of hook as it would probably No, it totally will. Yeah. Totally will. Maybe. Maybe. What about... Um, well, while we're talking about, you know, the, the big developers, mm. what about Naughty Dog? Do you think because... <coughs> well, what's your speculation? I, I, I've, I'll I've, comment I've on it. I've heard... Um, I heard mention somewhere that when they announced... When Uncharted 3 came out, mm. like a month later, there was The Last of Us, like, announced... So Uncharted 4 has been out for two months now. Yep. So that, if they're running by the same time frame, we may just get like, here's what we're working on now. Like, here's what's next. It's not coming out next year. It's not coming out the year after. This is a, a long-term thing, <clears throat> um, whether it be The Last of Us 2 or something completely different altogether. I don't care. But the, like Naughty Dog are... The, the one of the biggest game companies in the world. Yeah. Maybe the biggest now since Uncharted. They, they've got to be there in some respect. They've got to do <clears throat> something. Not we're sitting on our hands for the next three years. No, I, I, I don't think they'll be looking Last of Us 2. They might show <clears throat> some really basic concept art, maybe. Of? Of, of Last of Us 2. They might be like, hey, look, it's in the works. There's yeah. no plans, <clears throat> no gameplay footage, no teaser trailer. It's here are some pictures. But I will think they'll talk about the DLC for Fallout 4. Uh, the Fallout 4. Fallout 4. Uncharted, Uncharted 4. Because okay. they mentioned that there is story DLC, first of its kind. This yeah. way we'll find out exactly what it is and what they plan to do with it. I'd be more excited about that if I'd finished Uncharted 4 yet. Not because True. I don't love it. I said time. I haven't had time. time. Well then, before you go on, piggybacking off the Naughty Dog thing, I would. this isn't so much as a, a prediction as a desperately want. Mm. I want Insomniac to come out and be like, we're doing a new Crash game. We've been licensed to do Insomniac. Crash. Yeah. Okay. Why not Insomniac? Who the fuck did Ratchet and Clank? Insomniac. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be awesome. Because they. No, I, I was Insomniac, like, oh, that'd be really interesting. When Insomniac have just shown, <coughs> you know, these three D puzzle platformers. Mm. Like, that's their thing. Like Ratchet and Clank is amazing, and like to keep it in Sony because I know Activision still have the right. So I just they love, do. I just love for Insomniac to go. We've got the the license to do Crash, and we are his. His, you know, his we've, we've worked in conjunction with Activision. Or even a, a remastered Crash <coughs> collection for PS4. See, that would be tough, though. Trying to up, you know... It's a long re- way to go, because you're going It's a big PS1. jump. I don't think it's doable, <coughs> but I'd like to see it. No, maybe not even a remaster, but you know. You know you know what I'm getting at. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, and I'd love it. Because <coughs> Sony said a few weeks ago about Crash, just a throwaway comment, but we hear you. Like, we know the demand for Crash Yeah, we reported there. here. Yeah, we know you want it. And <coughs> hopefully that sparked into going, what can we do oh, about thinking. it? You know, I'm getting, I'm getting randomly sick in the middle of a show again. That's not happening again, is it? Mm. Um, You're going to be hyperventilating off the side again? Maybe. Ne- <laughs> uh, I think virtual reality yeah. will be there in a big, bad way. And I'm not just talking Sony, which we know with PlayStation VR coming out later this year. Um, but we'll talk about that first. That will get a, re- a proper release date, not just an October window. Um, mm-hmm. Price won't change. We know the price is pretty solid. But and we'll also be uh, we'll find out what its release games are. God of War. We'll be God of War. Coming back. To it. However, I think Xbox will announce that they are working. Now we've reported on this previously. I think I think I wrote it in the lab report for uh, the Xbox new consoles um they will be making it looks like they'll be making a partnership with oculus rift uh in an attempt to be part of the vr marketplace it's not going to work for them they're too late that shit's expensive they're too late 
way too late. I don't want VR. I think that, no, I think they'll announce it only in order to join the party. I don't think VR will be. A, obviously, there'll be a lot spoken about, but you can't really demonstrate. No, know? no, it's it's near impossible to show. Yeah. But they'll talk about the games, and they'll be like, "These are the games." They won't show you how it works in VR. Hopefully, yeah. there's no awkward people on stage with shit in front of their face going. Oh look! Oh, we're gonna fall. Uh-huh. <coughs> I don't want any of that. Yeah. But like, if they say, "Look, these are the games that are coming." Look, they've already got my pre-order. They've already got my six hundred bucks. Okay, oh, so yeah, so like, just give, let me know what game is coming yeah, out. There's always plenty to talk about with Sony and Microsoft. What about Nintendo? Like, what are they going? To <coughs> they don't have anything. I know. What are they going to do? They all, all they have is here's Zelda playable on the floor. Uh, they also announced that Pokemon Sun and Moon will be come, will be there. Yeah. In what respect, I don't know. Yep. They have their Treehouse event on uh, Wednesday. That sounds so pedophilic. Yeah. Come I don't know. What, I don't know what's going to come out of there. I do, uh, see because they don't have a conference Pokemon per Go, se. Surely n- they're not having a conference, so they're not going to announce anything. They, n- they haven't <laughs> had a conference for you. Even though their video directs, there is no video, video direct over yeah. E3. Um, I think maybe there'll be some t- things discussed. People go to the Nintendo booth and discuss about Zelda. We're not going to. We're not going to get a release. Hey date. guys, this game going to be good. Yeah. Like we're not going to get. There'll be nothing that comes out of Nintendo. Did- uh, this might be their last E3. And E3, uh, so Nintendo have to move in a big bad way. If the NX, they do some. If the NX doesn't do well, mm. like because the Wii U's failed fucking horribly, like, what are they going to do? What know. are they going to do? I don't it make know. a good discussion. In it the would future, make a good actually. discussion. But my next pick is from the Ubisoft conference. Mm-hmm. I am talking about South Park. And their sequel, butthole. their sequel to the Stick of Truth, a fractured butthole. Such a good name. I expect I, I would like a release date or a release window, yeah. and a bit more of the story or gameplay. I don't want windows. <clears throat> I want dates. Yeah. Tell me when I'm getting this game, and don't delay it. Yeah. Well, yeah. so the, the Stick of Truth was delayed like twice three yeah, times maybe times. but they did lose like the publisher went under yeah. during production yeah. so that's a little bit more for but the game came out and was amazing yeah and look it's like Trey and Matt uh, they are uh, I took on my first name based like my best friends Trey Parker and Matt Stone I don't think they're working on anything but South Park at this point yeah. Book of Mormon is wrapped at this point oh it's still around but they're not working on it because mm-hmm. when South Park, when Stick of Truth came out they were doing the show and the and the Broadway and the game like it was nuts but I want because remember that was the best surprise of last year it was I was watching the Ubers like, this is really this chick is horrible like don't yeah. why is she presenting oh my god <laughs> South Park <laughs> yeah, you think <clears throat> like with what they had last year mm. to this year they must have a rough date in mind yeah surely I want to talk about the legend himself and newcomer to Sony Hideo Kojima okay He's got to be there in some form. Even if he just comes out on stage and says, I'm grateful to be a part of Sony. Yeah. Like, they've given me the freedom to do what I want to do or something. Or, we've seen the logo. Apparently, that, that character <clears throat> that was, you know, the logo that was yeah. released. And then we got another picture with the, the skull mask down as well to see the guy underneath it. Apparently, he has a name. It's, it's, it sounds German. It's Lubens or something. It sounds German. Mm-hmm. Um, that character <coughs> just looks so... Cool. It would be a shame not to use it in a game of some sort. Okay. At the very best, like here's what I'm working on. Only concept art, no video. But yeah, here is the, what I'm there'll doing. be no video. There'll be no release window. There'll be nothing. Because It'll essentially be, hey guys, I'm Hideo Kojima. Um, he got signed what two two months ago? Yeah, three, three four months. But like, there's no time for them to have done. He's like, anything. we've not done anything. Sony's pretty cool. And they're better than that fucking Konami. <laughs> um. And that's it. Um, Metal, I'm working on a new game called Metal Gear Flaccid. <laughs> Metal, Metal Gear Erect. Uh, no, these one, a couple of these we've discussed and have since sort of been confirmed since. Um, I've written here, because I wrote this list on Thursday, of, uh, sorry, Saturday of last week. So that was about six days, five, six days ago at this point. Preface. Have a thong. Yeah. <laughs> um, Horizon Zero Dawn will get its release date. That's already been already announced uh, yeah. with uh, March of next year for Australia. Think there'll be any more footage, or they've just there, dropped there, this trailer. There will be more. There it. will be more talk about Horizon, but I think they wanted to take away the sting. Yeah. 
of the release date and put it before. Yeah, That's how they go around it. Clever. Yeah. Uh, Watch Dogs 2, which was announced today. Today is Thursday. Officially announced Officially today. announced today. Yeah. Um, I expect that to come out of the, the Ubisoft conference. I think yeah. we will get more out of it from them. However, I think in order to take the sting of the previous uh, Watch Dogs at E3, they've gone, all right, let's just get this out of the way. <laughs> so when it comes in, we can just talk about the game. Yeah. <clears throat> and not let the hype train ruin it. Yeah. yeah. But on a good note, like they've, they've announced it's coming out in November. Like compared to the previous... <laughs> almost two years that the first Watch Dogs was when it first announced when it came out. This is like, hey, it's coming out in six months. They, they freaking Bethesda did it. They, they fall out it. <laughs> they fall out it. They fall, they fall out of did it. <laughs> it. Phrasing. Yeah. Well, speaking of Bethesda, what are they doing? What do you think they're going <clears> to... <throat> okay. Because <clears throat> we spoke in the last video about the Skyrim, the possible... Yeah, that's also on my list as well. Skyrim remastered. Skyrim remastered for current gen. But... You know, they just had Doom, yeah, which so apparently is doing amazing. We will well. see Dishonored 2, yeah, because they talked about that last year. Um, we'll get some talk about Doom in terms of a DLC, because I do believe there's a season pass out. Yeah. We will get more Fallout 4 news. There may be more DLC in the future, um, or at least numbers or something like, along those lines. However, Wolfenstein, I think we'll get some more Wolfenstein as well. It's been a couple of years we talked about it in the news. Mm-hmm. Now, Wolfenstein and Doom are both ID software there's one property that ID Software have that no one's touched. What is that? It's Quake. I remember Quake. I remember Quake. There Those are... fucking LAN parties, <laughs> the lock- lock-ins. <clears throat> like, I think they've realised that people are wanting these franchises. Like, yeah. there's a there's nostalgic value. Yeah. But, when but there's well, enough like... time to yeah. make it new. Well, like Doom, for example. Yeah. Which is doing amazing. I... I'm wondering if this whole Skyrim remaster is pushing back what might be the next Elder Scrolls game. Uh, see, as we've talked about, or in the in the previous video, um, they made this. They they made this remaster as oh, yeah, a. I know. But as, you so, so think... already, they, all they're going to do is spit on it, give it a bit more polish. No, no, but you also got to think <clears throat> the the time, money, and resources that would have been put into it, and would still be getting put into it as well. What I'm hoping is. But this is obviously side. This is outside of E3. The Bethesda are working on a new engine, yeah. and it's, it's that with that comes a lot longer in. Like it's going to take a lot longer to the redesign engine. Yeah. So this is designed to sort of get people to you know, hey, I'd love play for them this. To say, I'd love for them to say, look, we're working on a new engine. It's going to be a while before you see yeah. something new from us. So here's this. So until then, here's Skyrim Remastered. That's DLC. exactly what I would want to hear. I want to be like, hey, we are working on the new engine. Look, we're working on, we are working on an Elder Scrolls 6. Yeah. However. It's a long until, while away. However, until then, Enjoy here's, Skyrim. here's Skyrim Remastered. And the crowd's like, Bah! And everyone just like literally pisses their pants. It's just an uh, instantaneous ejaculation. Of the room. Ah, oh, it's just going to be an absolute It's mess. like the little Japanese water fountains. Yeah. It's just, <laughs> like a gush it'd be, it'd, be, it'd be like the scene from The Shining where the elevator doors open just blood <laughs> but it's semen but it's semen and lady and lady juices <laughs> and the Bethesda rep oh. <laughs> 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 I'm drowning splashing <laughs> okay now this one is easy I'm talking Gears of War 4 yeah it's given we've talked about it a lot they, they talked about it last year they showed some some gameplay footage it was actually really good you have an Xbox in the house. I have an Xbox in the house. We can probably play it. Now, this is we're talking about, we talk about our predictions before we started recording, and Dylan was like, I don't give a shit for it's not going to have Marcus in it. I don't want to watch Baby Gears of War. Who are these jerks? No. So, so Gears of War in your kinder. <coughs> Same graphic blood and everything. Mm. It's just toddlers just massacring. But yeah, as someone that doesn't know a lot of Gears, I just know that it will be announced. It's going to have to be announced. And while keeping it at Microsoft, will we get new Halo? Doubt it. Way too soon. Apparently, the work the Halo Wars Two is being worked on. Maybe. Yay. But uh, what else we got? Back to Sony. I think we'll hear Our what boys. sucker. I think we'll hear what sucker punch are doing. What like the new Spider Man? That's the rumor. So the rumor mill is that they're working on that Spider Man game. I doubt that's a, uh, as awesome as that would be. I just want to know what they're doing. I don't think regardless it would be, of. I don't think it would Spider-Man. be Spider awesome. Man. See, I, I don't want that because I'm not a big fan of Spider-Man. Yeah. 
I'm sure it'd be amazing, but it's not. <laughs> that's not an IP. What? It'd be amazing. Oh, it wouldn't Mate, be spectacular. It, yeah. It'll be astonishing. Uh, but it's not, it's not an IP that I'm that keen on. Yeah. But I'll play it anyway. Look, to me, it's too by the numbers from Sucker Punch. I want them to see something different. Like, they've essentially now made... You mean what, a new IP. Four games. Infamous games. Under Infamous. Yeah. Like, give me something but new. But the thing with Infamous is... It's there. Like, the potential is there. They're good games. They are good games. But... I don't know. They're... There's just something missing to, from making it a phenomenal series. Mm. Like, I, I'd love to, maybe not now, but I'd love to see them revisit Infamous at some point with whatever they've learned over a couple of years and be like, you know, blow our fucking minds yeah. with that game. But that yeah. wouldn't be this year. No. Uh, what else have I got on my list? I'm starting to run starting towards the tail Star end. Wars. Star Wars. What's coming in Star Because there's three games? There's three works in... To- there's three in... Uh, in titles three in titles works. in the works at EA. Uh, Battlefront 2, we know to be a thing. Mm-hmm. Um, and they said that they would be looking at doing a more single-player campaign-focused oh, game. Oh, really? Yep, due oh, to Backlash. Yeah. And they also, in that same announcement, said, look, we rushed this one because we needed to tie it with the movie so like we're sorry but yeah. the next one will be a bit better we're sorry but please buy <clears throat> another give us another $80 please and there are two other EA game, uh, EA Star Wars games in the works one of them being the one that Amy Henning's working on from uh, one of the original writers of Uncharted mm-hmm. so it's whatever it's going to be a good story game for Star Wars and that's well apparently her Uncharted 4 script was scrapped yeah, because she worked yeah. on Uncharted Four for a while and then she left. Yeah, but when and Neil when, Druckmann when comes Neil in, Druckmann, like, you don't you don't come in and you don't like, try to continue. No, I know. Yeah, but I'm, I'm what I'm saying is I'm interested in what direction she was taking the game. I'm sure it was fantastic. Mm. Obviously, would it would be interesting to kind of get a script? Lit, you know, here's the script. Here's he was her pitch for Uncharted yeah. Four. But speaking of EA though, uh, one game that I would like. This is my pipe dream. Oh, okay. This is the one that I want more than words. Uh, Skate 4. What are you going through your phone for? Getting pictures of times. Oh, for no. Skate 4. Really? I never yeah. played that. For oh, I love Skate. That's awesome. If they can get on the next gen consoles... You're happy, man. Yes. That would be amazing. What's your pipe dream? And then we'll, when we'll start wrapping uh, things up. This is something that's never, ever, ever going to happen. But what they're doing with Final Fantasy 7... Mm. Do it with number 8. You know, I've spoken since for two years since we've been doing the show anytime I get a chance I'll say Final Fantasy 8 is my favourite game of all time which you can see on my personal video the youtube.com slash the pop culturist ha um, I'd, I'd just love to see that remastered yeah. Not a, no, there's no like cool little new things I like like I'm a nostalgia freak and I know you, you hate me a little bit for it a little bit a lot but you'd, you'd spit in my mouth giving the chance. I would. Let's let, let's wrap things up. So we'll, we'll we'll go we'll run through the conferences and we'll quickly wrap up everything that we've discussed. So EA, which will uh, take place on the twelfth of June at one p.m. Pacific. That's the thirteenth of June at six a.m. for us. That's Monday. So Monday's a public holiday in Victoria. Lucky. Take advantage of that. Uh, so yeah. So we, so we're expecting to see Star Wars. Mm-hmm. We'd like to see Skate. What else, what else is coming out of EA? That's it for EA. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I quiet. think with three Star Wars games in the works, there's yeah, we'll pro- time we'll for We'll probably see more Madden, probably see more NBA, mm. the usual garbage. Uh, Bethesda, which is at 12, on the 12th of June at 7 p.m. Pacific or 12 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Times, also on the Monday. Mm-hmm. As we talked about, we're expecting uh, Wolfenstein 2, Prey 2, Dishonored. Uh, probably some more flat Fallout and hopefully a Skyrim remastered. Yes, and hopefully a new engine talk, maybe. Yeah. Uh, Microsoft, 13th of June at 9.30 a.m. Uh, Pacific Standard Time or the 14th of June at 2.30 a.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. Fuck. It's going to be a garbage one. Uh, new consoles. Okay, so Microsoft. Okay. Yeah, new consoles, Gears of War, potentially Halo. Oh, and Cuphead. Tell me when the fuck Cuphead's coming out, you dicks. I reckon that might be when they go, it's available digitally now. I'm going to shit my pants if it is. I'm literally going to shit my pants. Because you've taken the week off work. I have. So you're going to spend a couple of days here. Maybe. So you can wait. You can go, hey, 
let's play Cuphead. It's Microsoft. Now. I'm like, what? Oh, that's cool. Let's get up. <laughs> I'll be like, hey, it's Microsoft. You're like, fuck off. I don't care. Like, fuck off. And you're like, no, no, they just announced Cuphead. I'm like, what? They say Cuphead's available now. Yeah. Dylan, get the fuck out of bed. We need your Xbox. <laughs> it's probably set up ready to go. We don't need Dylan. Oh, okay. um, there's also a PC gaming conference. Uh, <laughs> but se- <laughs> seeing as there is really game on PC. Let um, me tell you how good these new NVIDIA drivers are. Check for tw- out for twenty minutes. Check out the clickiness of this sweet keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> and this is a conference. Is it? <laughs> There's someone playing. In Don't the get me wrong. I fucking love There's my. Someone me- playing in the BIOS. I fucking love right my now. mechanical keyboard, but um, yeah. PC is not for us. No. Thirteenth uh, of June at one p.m. Pacific is Ubisoft, or fourteenth of June at six a.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. Uh, as we said, Star Wars. I'm not Star Wars. Park. Uh, South Park. Yes. Watch Dogs will be there. Maybe some talk of what they're going to do with Assassin's Creed in the future. Um, well, maybe a new Far Cry. On Assassin's Creed, I remember hearing they were taking a break. To they did the take yeah. a bit of a rest. Maybe they're like, "Hey, look, it's, we're not. We, we haven't forgotten about it. Like they haven't really have they released. Yeah. They haven't released a game this year. No, and they're not. Yeah, they're not going to. Which means then that like it's six I months. I think they're time. going bi monthly. Mm, bi yearly. Bi yearly. Uh, they could do bi monthly, and the games wouldn't be any worse than they are now. Yeah, true. Uh, and then to f- end. The conferences is Sony with 13th of June at 6 p.m. Pacific. Uh, in the Australia, it is the 14th of June at 11 a.m. I'll be at work. Be sure. Be do- I'm in training. I'm going to be going. Wait, what day is that for us? The, which one's that? Thursday or Friday? Same. The 14th of June is a Tuesday. That can't be right. No, that can't be right. Talk about yourselves. No. Yeah, no, it's next, next Tuesday. Oh. Everything happens over Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. Oh. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday for us. Yeah, so it's Wednesday for us. I think I got my dates wrong. Okay. Either way, I'm going to be at work in the training room. Like That is one I can comfortably wake up, go grab a coffee, sit down, and enjoy. Yeah. I'm going to sit there at work like this. Like, they'll be teaching me new things. I'm going... Yay! <laughs> ah! What's that? No, just... <laughs> Those statistics are really good. Woo! Yeah, like, I like how you talk about electricity meters. <laughs> yeah. Is it and? and? And that's it. That's it. Um, and from Sony, as, as you said, VR, Neo, uh, there's a lot that we discussed. God of War, obviously because we're PlayStation big fans. Um, that's he- the one. Hence Drake and, and Kratos. And I know you're training, Dylan's. but you can't get that one day off. Just the one for Sony. I physically can't. Look, I'm going to have to tell Mike, look, this is massively important. I'm going to need to, like... I'm paying attention, but I'm also going to be needing to watch this. Like, it, or just watch, like, a live tweet. You can watch our Twitter for live tweets, because I'll be doing it. He will be. The, to get me to lock it there'll be tons, a tons of coverage from the pop culturists for E3. Whether it be from myself, whether it be from Jock, whether it be from Dylan, whether it be from Alistair, or Brittany even. We're all going to have some things to and say. And we'll find a way to work some ch- video chats about them. Yeah, this. well, we, we weren't, just due to time, we weren't able to get breakdowns directly after the show. But Ooh. we'll try to get it up within the day <laughs> to sort of be like, this is what we thought of this, what we thought of this. And um, we'll break it down. I'm sure there'll be some... There'll be a some lot further predictions stuff. about what this means or what <clears> this <throat> new game yeah. means and... So I guess you can expect from us live tweets throughout the day, uh, lab reports on the website for, yep. the, for the big news can. worth, you know, I can do some of them too, yep. for the big news worth writing something about and video content. Because no doubt I will always be getting bombarded with press So releases. please, please keep in mind this is the first time we're actually covering E3 in this be respect, gentle. so be gentle. We're a small team, but we'll do our best for you. But if you want to see where we can do this, of course, facebook.com slash thepopculturist, youtube.com slash thepopculturist, down below, like, subscribe, because it'll be kept up to date with all our videos. Speaking of videos, I hope you've really enjoyed our uh, Meet the Team videos. Yes. Which, which, they were fun the to t- make. By the time this comes out, all of them should be out. Correct. Yeah. Uh, and of course, live tweet at, at thpopculturist. We're still trying to get pop culturists it's uh, taken by some jerks I'm going to email them and be like tweet at them well, you fucks for us. I can't no, wait don't. oh yeah if you want to if you want us like I want to have that that handle so if you message at pop culturists tweet at them tell them to give it up you dicks 
They don't say dicks. I feel like that's not the kind of community we want. No. To Can you just be like, hey guys, you've not posted <laughs> since 2012, uh, 2014. Can you just that's shut the two account years. down? Can these guys please have your handle? And I'd be like, thank you very much. Uh, I love and you. And they'll probably say no. Because they're in the, tw- in the, th- in the in like popculturist.com. Like, we own that. Yeah. No. It's got 60 pictures of you on it. So, mm. um, I'm Ryan Betson. I'm Josh Thomas. Uh, this is the end of our experiment. We'll see you next week. Yeah. How long are we holding that for? <laughs> Fart! <laughs> you know, if you had to soundboard a fart, that was it. <laughs>